George and Lawrence, we heard that Ellie Vaz's mother Nikki is taking both of you to Six Flags Great America today. And since we don't have the 1998 VHS of Babe right now, us, Shirley, Ellie, and our friends will watch other comedy movies at home. Oh boy. That must be Mrs. Visor. She is a great mother to Ellie, and she has arrived at her house. I have to agree with my brother George. And she's already here. We'll get it. George and Lawrence, are you both excited for Six Flags Great America today? I booked the trip for today, with just only both of you and me. My daughter Ellie, Shirley, Katie, Amanda, Sammy, William, Brittany, and Jeffrey told me about the good things you both are doing with them since the past few months. Yes. We're excited for the big trip. You get to have a big day today. Nikki, you are the perfect one for us, because you give us rewards for helping your daughter Ellie, who works at Ice Bats Ice Cream Parlor. We bet that Ellie, Shirley, Katie, Amanda, Sammy, William, Brittany, and Jeffrey will watch comedy movies at home. They will have a great time at home too. I agree with my brothers. Same here. George and Lawrence, you get to go to Six Flags Great America with my mom while we hang out at your house. We're on it Ellie and Mrs. Visor. That's exactly what I like to hear from both of you. George and Lawrence, let's go to the car. And Shirley, Winona, and Henry, just let me know if anything goes wrong during the trip. Okay. Have fun at Six Flags Great America. I'll see you when you get home. We will be home for our family movie. Take care. Bye kids. Enjoy your visit. Good luck boys. Make sure you behave at the park. You can buy some snacks at the park if you want. Call me if you need me. Enjoy your Six Flags Great America trip. George and Lawrence. Would you both like to ride on the American Eagle? This is a wooden roller coaster. I think both of you will love that as much as my daughter Ellie. Yes. Sure thing Mrs. Visser. You are the nicest woman who takes care of your daughter Ellie. Okay George and Lawrence, we will ride on the American Eagle, then we will ride other thrill rides such as Batman the Ride, the Flash Vertical Velocity, Max Force, Raging Bull, Viper, Giant Drop, Goliath, The Wizard, X-Flight, Superman Ultimate Flight, The Dark Knight Coaster, Justice League Battle for Metropolis, Mardi Gras Hangover, Revolution, Daredevil Dive, The Joker, and The Demon. And we will have something to eat for lunch at the park. Eloise, get down from the table. You're not getting Dippin' Dots ice cream or other snacks at Six Flags Great America today. I agree with my friend and co-worker Lexi Carroll. There are some Little Debbie Red, White, and Blue Brownies, Pillsbury Chocolate Chip Cookies, Fruit Loops Cereal Bars, Nestle Toll House Chocolate Chip Cookies, Spider-Man Fruit Snacks, Pixar Fruit Snacks, Rice Krispy Treats, Hostess Dinettes, Drake's Coffee Cakes, Keebler Fudge Stripes Cookies, Little Debbie Donut Sticks, Nutter Butter Cookies, Betty Crocker Super Moist Lemon Cake, Jell-O, Briar's Ice Cream, Meyer Purple Cow Ice Cream, Orville Radenbacher Popcorn, Pringles, and Grandma's Mini Sandwich Creme Cookies at home. We have to agree on what Aliyah and Lexi said. Stop it right now. Shut up Aliyah, Lexi, and Alejandro. The store-bought snacks at home taste like dog poop and cat pee. If you three won't buy me a dip in Dots ice cream, I will bully George and Lawrence, who are the Bloomingdale brothers, as well as a rip-off to the Williams sisters and the stage twins. No Eloise. You better not do that to the Bloomingdale brothers. If you do that to them, we are leaving Six Flags Great America and going straight back home early, and we will make you eat an Uncrustables peanut butter and grape jelly sandwich for lunch, and Chef Boy RD spaghetti and meatballs for dinner. That's right. You better sit down, now. That's it. 
I will push the Bloomingdale brothers right now. Don't you dare. If you do, then we will go home. <laughs> L.O.E.S. Stop it right now. Me, Lawrence, and Mrs. Visor are trying to eat our lunch. So sit back down right now before Mrs. Visor tells your sister on you. I agree with my brother George. Eloise, stop it right now or you're not getting anything at all. Shut up George and Lawrence. Both of you shouldn't have existed in America, you stupid childish twin boys. Eloise, stop pushing George and Lawrence. You need to listen to your sister Alia, her co-worker Lexi Carroll, and Alejandro Rodriguez right now. You can either deal with only the meal and the store-bought snacks or you're leaving Six Flags Great America and going home early with them. Eat an Uncrustables peanut butter and grape jelly sandwich and stay in your room until they make you Chef Boyardee spaghetti and meatballs for your dinner at home. Shut up Mrs. Visor. You are nothing but a stupid lady who has a daughter named Ellie who works at that stupid Ice Bats ice cream parlor. You know what Eloise, we have had enough of you. We are leaving Six Flags Great America right now and going straight back home. I agree on what your sister Alia and her friend Lexi said. Eloise, how dare you bully George and Lawrence at Six Flags Great America. You know that it is very disrespectful to do, and you can get arrested for that. That's it. You're going home with Alia. You will be eating an Uncrustables peanut butter and grape jelly sandwich for lunch, and you're also getting Chef Boyardee spaghetti and meatballs for dinner instead. Get in the car right now. You are grounded for two weeks, and I will be telling your parents when they get home from work. Get out of this park right now. You're coming home with your sister Alia and you're not getting anything at all. You will receive punishments when you get home. Come with me right now. Ah. It's okay boys. Eloise is going home with her sister and she's going to be grounded. You can finish eating your food if you want. Thank you Mrs. Visser. You're welcome. Let's resume our normal activities, finish eating our meals, and then go on some more thrill rides. George and Lawrence, both of you have been very good twins for the whole trip, even when Eloise was pushing you until her sister Alia had to take her home. That's right Mrs. Visor. That naughty troublemaking girl needs to accept the store-bought snacks at home, but she pushed me and Lawrence several times at the county fair food court. You did a good job telling Alia to take Eloise home early for her bad behavior at Six Flags Great America. You did a really good job telling her to take her home for the bad behavior that she had, especially for having a tantrum while standing up on the table. No problem George and Lawrence, you both are ungrounded because both of you have been very good twin brothers throughout the whole time we were having fun at Six Flags Great America. I will tell my husband Irvin, my daughter Ellie and your parents and sister Shirley about both of your behavior at Six Flags Great America. No need to worry, but that is very kind of you. Mrs. Visor, you're our best hero of all time, just like your daughter Ellie. Thank you for everything Mrs. Visor. We also got some Oreo funnel cakes from Antoine's funnel cakes for our snack. Me and Lawrence will also tell our parents, Shirley, Ellie, Amanda, Sammy, Katie, William, Brittany and Jeffrey that Eloise was a very bad girl today. I have to agree with my brother George. We will tell them that she was a very bad girl today. Well then, let's enjoy the rest of our day at Six Flags Great America with more thrill rides and dinner at the park. Mm -hmm. 